Feedback and Self-Monitoring by Academy of Learning Career College Another important element of practicing is creating opportunities for feedback. Feedback can be generated by an instructor from a system such as an online test engine, is inherent in the task, for example, software tasks that are either successful or not, or by learners themselves. Good feedback is specific, focused on the task, and provides areas that learners can improve. When learners can identify areas that are weaker, it can help them to focus their studying most effectively on the concepts and procedures that need the most practice. When learners create their own feedback, we call this self-monitoring. It is a great idea for learners to self-monitor. However, as humans, we tend to be inaccurate in our self-monitoring. Part of this is because most humans tend to be biased towards optimism. For example, most people believe they are a better-than-average driver. In addition, learners often judge whether they understand a concept or can perform a task based on how easy it feels and how often they make this judgment when the information is in front of them. For instance, learners judge whether they know a concept when that content is displayed right in front of them. Good practice includes task completion without materials in front of the learner, allows learners to check against correct materials, can include specific goals such as explaining an idea or process to a peer or summarizing key points or steps of a process without reference to notes. Means learners can say, I know I'm ready for this test because I've done X, Y, and Z, rather than saying, I feel ready for the test.